Hello everybody, welcome to iBlockchain channel. In this short course, I will teach you how to create your own decentralized exchange from A to Z. I will teach you everything uh, and how to create this DEX by yourself step by step, how to edit the code, how to change everything. Okay, first we have to see a demo. Okay, your DEX will look like this one. Swap Ocean. It is from swapocean.com. Uh, and after you finish your decks, it will be look like this one. The users can swapping between tokens. Okay, like that. Also, you can add more tokens here. You can add your token. You can add any BIP20 token here in the default list. Also, I will teach you how to add some uh, links to the left side menu and of course how to edit this social links to be your links, how to change the logo, how to change the site title, how to do all these things. Okay, let's move to the first step. The first step we have to download the source code. Okay. Go to 0xfactory.com from this website. You can buy and download the, the source code, the full source code. From the left side menu here in Decentralized Exchange, click here. Okay. On this page, you can download the DEX. You can download the soul. You can download the full source code for only $25. Of course, this is very, very cheap to buy a complete source code for decentralized exchange by only this amount, only $25. Uh, $25. Okay, now the first step, how to buy this, how to download it. Click download now. This will lead you to this page. From this page, you, can, you will pay $25, you can be using Bitcoin, BNB, Doggy, choose whatever you want. For example, we will uh, buy using Bitcoin. Okay. Okay. Just send uh, this amount of Bitcoin, exactly this amount, to this address. You can copy the address and send this amount to this address or scan the QR code by your mobile and send this amount of BTC okay after the payment finished you will automatically redirect to the download page and you will download the full source code for the DEX now we already downloaded it let's move to the next section okay after your payment completed you will download this file dexsource.zip just extract this zip file Okay, great. After extracting the DEX source zip file, we will find inside two files, file and folder. The file help, here this is just text file, to give you some tips about what to do. Okay, we will discuss all this, so no need for this. And the DEX folder. This DEX folder contains all the DEX source code so we have to open the dex folder using visual studio okay download visual studio and open the dex folder by visual studio like that okay this is the visual studio we already opened dex folder here we will find uh, the source folder if you have if you have some information or you already have some skills about uh, react you will uh, find this very easy if you don't have any uh, react skills. It's okay. No problem I will teach you and you can just follow my tips uh, Step by step and you will reach to the target. Okay first How to change how to change the uh, logo? how to change the logo file Okay, let's back to the folder the dex folder and open public folder okay in public folder here we will find the image the logo images just replace your logo by all these images 
in the same sizes okay because you will find uh, some images uh, with a different sizes okay also here on the image folder click and this image the logo with text.bang this is the logo image okay so replace this image by your logo that's all nothing else just to replace all these images here and inside images folder by your logo and your images nothing else when you replace it you will find it appear here on the text okay okay great so what else how we can add some links here on the left menu open visual studio code and from source components you will find here menu click menu and config.ts open this file this config.ts okay here we will find home exchange and liquidity exactly the same home exchange liquidity and create token uh, it is different from this version so you will not find it here okay if you want to add something else like new link for example we will just copy this and paste it here and type here my new link for example and here you can put the icon uh, name and here new link okay and of course you want if you wanted to add external link like https slash as my link dot com it's okay no problem you can add internal or external links here so from the config.ts file you can add some uh, some new links to the text okay okay great so we can add many links here as we can okay the next step how to change the title the default title is the swap ocean exchange how to change this to my dex name okay close this file of course i don't want to see don't save this file and we need to change the website title we can find the website title in two files here public in public folder open index.html and scroll down to the line number what here yes to the line number 40 okay swap ocean x exchange you can change it to my exchange for example or my dex whatever you want okay so from here from the index file index.html file you can change the title the website title itself okay don't save not only this we have to change it from another place okay from source folder here in hox folder open hox folder and scroll down use get document title price this one this file also we need to change the document dot title here swap ocean exchange you will change this by your exchange name by your dex name type here whatever you want okay so we will change it to change the title of the dex we have to change the two files get uh, use get document title price.ts you will find it inside hox inside source folder and from public index folder here in line number 40 okay okay let's close this also now we learn it how to change how to add mini menus here how to add any links to the left side menu and how to change the website title and how to change here the uh, the logo and all images now we need to change 
something very important also we need to change these links the social links from where we can change these links okay let's back again to visual studio code here on the node modules okay scroll down until find swap ocean where swap ocean swap ocean at the swap ocean yes here at swap ocean this okay and open index.cgs.gs okay over this file and index.esm.gs both files okay and scroll down until the line number yes here until the line number 200 uh, 2488 here var social this is the social links home telegram twitter and your token info means your token uh, link on bsc scan okay so you will put your links here your uh, website home page your telegram uh, link and your twitter link and of course your token uh, smart contract here okay and the uh, next the other uh, the other file also we will scroll down and tell the line number yes here until the line number 2475 uh, 2, okay we will change the same links changes by your links your website home page your telegram link your twitter link and your token link on bcc okay so to change the social links here you have to open these two files index.cgs.gs and index.esm.js and you can find these two files inside node modules and after that inside swap ocean then dist okay nothing else just change this links by your links and the close of course save okay great so now we already learn it what we what we still missing we learned how to change the logo, how to change the title, how to add to the left menu, how to change the social links here. Okay, very important point, how to add your token to the swap, uh, to uh, the default swapping list, how to add your token here. And also you can add any BIP20 token. Okay, let's see. Open Visual Studio Code okay from source and here constants okay and click token and swap ocean.json file open this okay this is the list you can find this is the default list okay and what if you want to add your token for example just for example copy this okay and paste and we here we will add your new token new token type here the token name and here's the symbol and t k n for example okay and here your token contract and of course uh the chain id 56 leave it like that because 56 is the chain id of binance smart chain and the decimals of course this is uh, your token decimals the most tokens 18 decimals but if your token something different like 9 or 10 or whatever type here your token decimal and here your logo URL okay this is your token logo URL when you add your token here and save you can find your token already added to the uh, swapping list so you can add your token or add any other 20 uh, bit 20 token okay from this file from source constants token 
and the file swap ocean.json. From this file, you can add your token and you can add any other PIP20 token to the DEX. Okay, I think now we already learned everything about how to edit your DEX. We already learned everything. I think we didn't missing anything. Okay, and of course here the, the users can add liquidity. Here the users can swap. You already learned how to add your token, how to add uh, new links to the menu, how to change the social links, how to change the logo. Okay, last step. This is the last step. How to build or how to deploy the next. Okay, this is very easy. How to deploy it. Okay, of course, I will not say it. Okay. Here, from the terminal, type new terminal. Okay. From the main menu of uh, Visual Studio Code, from terminal menu, click new terminal. Here, okay. Here we need to build uh, a deploy version. Okay. We need to build our text. Just type yarn build only that yarn build enter. Of course, after you already finished all modifications you want. Wait, we just will wait a few minutes. Actually, maybe a few seconds. We will see now. Visual Studio Code will create new build folder, and this folder contain all the files we need to deploy our decks. Sometimes it takes two minutes, I think. Maximum two minutes. Just wait. Great. It finished already. Built a new build folder. Here we can find build folder. Okay, open this folder. This folder have all the files we need to publish our decks. What you want to what you have to do now, just upload this folder, build folder, all these files, upload this folder to your server and it will work directly. No any configurations or installations. Just upload all these files to your uh, shared hosting and of course it can work with any shared hosting, but this shared hosting uh, must uh, support Node.js. If you don't know or you don't sure your uh, web hosting company support or not, I think uh, there is many uh, famous uh, web hosting companies like uh, Hostinger.com. Actually, I prefer Hostinger.com. You can find the Hostinger link on the video description also. And now we already learned everything about how to create our decentralized exchange exactly like this one by ourselves in just less than one hour okay okay thanks for watching and good luck if you like my video just click like and subscribe see you next video bye bye